dreams, all of our fantasies, everything that we want, sometimes our nightmares too, onto these people, and then we kind of connect to them in a particular kind of a way. There is no us with Andy Gerald, formerly of Marilyn Manson. They're out of Las Vegas. Great fucking band. Great fucking band. <sighs> I don't know. A lot of shit going on. But uh, duh, this is Peter Griffin. But anyway, there's uh, a guy who was getting laser surgery and farted and it started a fire. Uh, someone took a picture of it. So um, maybe I'll post that on Facebook. But uh, I'll have to do it when I'm in my uh, other segment. So set your DVRs, tune into this show, because you motherfuckers are going to tune out to watch The Walking Dead, which I don't blame you. I don't blame you one bit. But it is what it is. So the show always loses stats this time of year. Um, we've been to, doing pretty good at rockmetaltalk.com, but we also, you know, want to be heard more or less on the syndication. So that's what it's all about. This is just a recording format for it to push it all out there and share it with the rest of the world. There's a company in China that you can hire bridesmaids. At that point, if you have no friends, don't fucking worry about it. Your wedding will be cheaper. Yeah, It, 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 it doesn't make any sense. An Italian doctor creates an ice cream that improves sporting performance. Does it improve the wood? I don't know. And they This guy's got guard balls. Holy shit. A Spanish junkyard owner replaces guard ball dog guard dogs because I gotta get rid of my New York accent, you know, because I almost said dogs. Um guard dogs. With bullfighting bulls. I don't know what the fuck's going on in this world. But um, it's definitely insane. There's a guy who owned the company. He gave his fucking employees cars and apartments. That's what I call a boss. I wish uh, I could get something like that. I wouldn't leave my fucking job. No, instead I get my commission taken away and get replaced with $8 a day. But there's a $17,000 iPhone. I got to speed it up here because I got one more track to play. Then the guys from a fine line are calling in. 
There's a $17,000 iPhone. There's only 77 of them made. It's the lightest smartphone ever made. This company did it with some type of carbon fiber. Um, it's virtually indestructible for $17,000. Sorry. You better make fucking 17000 of them and make them $77. That's all I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, yo? But uh, let me get to this track. I got a couple of messages to read, and I'll be back with a fine line. Jay Stone, dead in Tarpon Springs, Florida. RockMetalTalk.com. That was a fine line. The curse. I'm Jay Stone. You're listening to my show at Rock 
MetalTalk.com. So we still got segments by Johnny O, Cats and Yama, Alicia's News, and Prickly Rickly with the Weekly Picks. The Prickly Picks. He got that name if you're a new listener. I know there's not many people listening right now because I checked the stats because everybody's watching fucking back episodes of The Walking Dead. Watching Glenn get his fucking eyeballs popped out with fucking Lucille. That's a whole nother mess. But uh, he got that name because Katsunyama mispronounced it on the air. So that's how he became Prickly Rickly. Just in case you didn't know. So I'm just waiting on these guys to call in here. They should be calling in any second. They're probably just trying to conference each other. So these guys, Justin was in the band Martyrs Asylum. Um, They parted ways. Uh, Martyrs Asylum got a new drummer. And now Justin's in a fine line. So we're going to talk to him, see what he's up to. The music sounds pretty good. It's definitely different from what you normally hear around this area. They're from Orlando. So they're about an hour and a half away from me. So hopefully they'll be doing a show in Tampa eventually and uh, getting out there. Um, Just messaging back and forth. I just had a brain fart. I didn't even know what I was thinking. But yeah, so if they have a play in in Tampa, I'll go see them. I'll check them out, see who they're playing with and... uh, it's just tough for me to get out there. Like I said, I've been working a lot, so I don't really know what my schedule is going to be. And, you know, people are uh, doing shift bids at work. I don't know how that's going to work because we merge with another company. And uh, I'm not sure how it's going to work. It's just, it's it's crazy. It's crazy. All right. I guess I'm in here. So here they are. Hey, what's going on, guys? Can you hear me? Yeah, absolutely. All right, these guys. 